Hey guys, if you're watching this, you're looking to rent my trailer. It's fantastic. So I just wanted to shoot a quick video uh, going through some of the basics. That way I don't have to uh, necessarily continue to do this each and every single time we rent it. And you have the ability to go back and watch the video and uh, touch up on some of the, the basics you need to know. So the first thing we'll start off with is I tend to get people who have never uh, rented a trailer before. So they don't know about the setup. And one of the biggest obstacles I've had to face so far is making sure that we have the proper setup on your vehicle. So let's take a look at first things first is having a two inch uh, receiver hitch. Now this can vary a little bit because there are different capabilities that you can have uh, to adjust that. But you want to have that already mounted, usually a class three hitch or higher. And this is the biggest thing is having the seven prong outlet right here. Most folks have not had that uh, when they call me. Uh, so it tends to be a challenge. So you want to make sure you have that on the newer vehicles. You could have in the body of the vehicle, you could have a, uh, a plate that comes out and it you know, opens up. And then you see access to this stuff on trucks and obviously my Jeep here. Uh, this was put on aftermarket, uh, which you can also have done fairly easily. A friend of mine and I put the uh, trailer hitch on and uh, the pr seven prong receiver. So that's what that's going to look like. 